how did you how did you actually meet purely by chance i was flying to south africa open the in-flight magazine and there's a story about theo and somehow it just immediately hit me this amazing story and as soon as i got back to england i rang him up and he said come and see me so i did and immediately i saw all these wonderful creations and for me it was like going into a toy shop for the first time <gasps> look at this one oh no no there's something wrong with it no look at this one no the colors not quite right there was something with everything typical designer and there was a piece that i absolutely desperately wanted to buy myself which i did and then i thought to myself well gosh you know other people would like to own pieces too and it was just by purely ch chatting with theo and he said i love designing them i love making them when it comes to business i'm lost and I said, well, why don't we do something together? And you might have expected him to jump at this, but he agonized for 18 months. And I only because found he truly out, was an artist. He, he abs truly was an absolutely. artist. And I only found out later, it wasn't whether he should work with me, it was more whether he was worthy of the Fabergé name. Isn't that amazing? That is amazing. And then look at what he produced. It is amazing. And how long did you actually know him? Uh, I worked with him for 23 years. 23 years, so that was a long time. Yeah. It really was. People often said to me afterwards, gosh, he's just so nice, so ordinary. But that was Theo. Theo um, was always surprised when people say, oh, these are magnificent. Do you really think so? Uh, you know, if you praised him, he always kind of was a bit shocked, he, right to the end. And a lot of famous designers do change an awful lot, uh, especially when they become really famous. And Theo did hundreds of TV interviews and and always after sort of surprise that people actually wanted to hear his story even. And do they really want to see more of the eggs again, you know? And he was such a, a beautiful man and such a kind person. After being working with Theo and traveling around the world for 23 years, I really do miss him a lot, tremendously. Uh, but it was still an honor to be there. And my thrill is really when people come up afterwards and really ask questions. And, and really get, try to understand why did Theo design that and oh now I understand that I really like this piece better than that one uh, because I understand his thought process that went right. through these pieces and the, every piece did have a tremendous amount of thought that went into it and why would he design it this way and that fascinated me too.